time for the bias sports report. So team Lidstrom beat team stall 11 to 10 in yesterday's NHL all-star classic, which was riveting to say the least. It's too bad. It was on at the same time as a, uh, according to Jim rerun, which was easily more entertaining to watch than the all-stars. I mean, really there's no effort there. Luckily the Celtics and Lakers were on too. That fantasy draft was fun, though, eh? Eric Stahl picked his teammate Cam Ward first overall. No Ovechkin, no Stamkos, not even a Sedin sister. With the first overall pick, I'm taking my boy, Cam Ward. Dum, 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 dum. Yep. As I predicted, the Leafs' Phil Kessel got picked last. And to prove to both Lidstrom and Stahl that that was a mistake not to pick him earlier... Kessel completely lit it up in the game by being the only guy on Team Lidstrom to not get a point. Fine. You guys are going to pick me last. I'll show you. I'm not going to get a point at all in the entire game. That'll show you. Charges have been dropped against the guy who threw waffles on the ice at a Leafs game. Uh Uh-oh. That's right. He's out there. Lock up the wife and kids. He said, quote, and this is actually a quote from him. Why can't we throw waffles? Because we think they're playing badly. People throw hats when they think they're playing good. Why can't we do something to show disapproval of what's happening over the last 44 years, especially in my lifetime, 25 years of robbing us and lies? Right on, brother. Keep throwing waffles. Send a message to the team. That's all I'm asking. If you know where the puck Patrick Kane used to score the Stanley Cup winning goal last June is, the FBI would like to speak to you. Uh-oh. They're, uh, they're looking for it. There's also a $50,000 reward for the puck. The FBI say, quote, drug smuggling and terrorism might go up, but we really need that puck. So if you know where it is, contact your local FBI branch. Hey, did you know the Pro Bowl was on yesterday? If you did, uh, you may have been the only one. The NFC beat the AFC 55-41. The score makes it sound really exciting. It wasn't. It was 35 nothing at one point for the NFC. Right on. I love all-star games. I really do. Even Sunshine Girl Caitlin wasn't excited. She's uh, 18. She didn't have much fun watching the, the all-star games. She does want to be an actress, though. She one time met Tracy Morgan. <laughs> if you, That's not a good start. I've, I've made a contact. Tracy Morgan. I met him. I watched Cop Out this weekend. Well, I watched 10 minutes of it until I had to turn it off. And can I say shame on you, Bruce Willis, for making that movie. Shame on you. You've uh, you've damaged Die Hard for me forever. And Kevin Smith directed that too. Way to go. That's uh, almost as good as Clerks or Mallrats. <laughs> Those two never lived that one down. <laughs>